if I click on the switch my LED is blinking and if I click on the switch my LED switch off so if I click on the button Hello everybody, today we will learn how to control our LED using Raspberry Pi using our mobile phone. Simply we can control our mobile phone, we can control our Raspberry Pi using our mobile phone and we can control our LED using our mobile phone or we can control our motor, step up motor or we can our control our door lock using our mobile phone just using a Raspberry Pi. So let's uh, go ahead with the procedure as you can see. We have to first install the uh, install the software install the node.js library in our Raspberry Pi. So here the command is I am I am I am running this command in my in my Raspberry Pi. Okay, I'm copying this. I am I am running in my terminal of raspberry pi okay okay then the next command i will give the link of this site in my description It is taking a little bit time. As you can see, this is my window of my Raspberry Pi. Okay, then we can install using this automatic command. Okay. Or we can install manually node.js updating my all software in, in Raspberry Pi as you can see this is my window of Raspberry Pi okay it's done then we have to install node.js Okay. I have to click on yes. It's taking to update okay finally done then finally we are installing node say okay and you have to just copy and paste the code here okay it is downloading the node JS. Okay, let's see. In the meantime, we have to check our node is installed or not, and I have to install Bilingual globally. Okay. Hmm. 
start loading node base. Sixty three percent, as you can see. Ninety five percent face. And it is unpacking. Okay, finally I installed the Node.js and I have to check it. finally is it installed or not. In my Raspberry Pi terminal. Okay, no problem. I can simply install npm filing globally and again paste npm command not font. That means automatic illustration might not work in this case. You can perform manual illustration. Use name gives a online page only try this. I can't try this. I can try this one. Okay. not working so I have to follow the manual procedure also sudo su cd dot out copy paste sudo su and then cd dot opt Not copying this. It's a little bit long for set as you can see. I am skipping the video for my time consuming. So now let's look. I am copying this last last command and pasting this. I already installed. Okay. Copy and paste and binding client. Okay, filing client and my authentication code. Okay, I'm copying my authentication code and pasting here. Okay, and clicking on this. And let's see. Okay, my binding is ready. Okay. Okay, as you can see, my bylink connection is ready. And now, if I on and off, 
my Swiss, it will automatically so as you can see if I click on the Swiss my LED is blinking and if I click on the Swiss my LED is switch off so if I click on the button here I can easily configure the button okay I can I choose the GP, GP, GPIO pin 7 and I use here Swiss I can use also here push and I can go back and I can run and again if I push the my LED will be uh, switch on and again if I left this switch my LED will switch off and again push my LED, LED is turn on okay this is how we can use our bi bi-link lag to control a LED light